Diagnosing eye problems in our patients can be very challenging because they can't tell us exactly what's wrong. A lot of dogs are very stoic and they don't show signs of discomfort. Other times we do have dogs that display discomfort more readily so they're squinting, they're tearing and that's a lot of times what the owners might pick up on. Years ago, we were very limited in what we could do for our pets. Nowadays, anything that's available to use for treatment or diagnostics or surgical intervention in people is pretty much available with our pets. What we like is when we see things in an earlier stage rather than chronic so that we can reverse the problems that are ongoing and restore or preserve vision and make the cornea more transparent so that our patients have better vision and be more comfortable long term. a lot of surgical procedures and common eye problems that are very well addressed by general practitioners. I and other ophthalmologists are there for those challenging cases of glaucoma or corneal injury or cataract surgery to achieve the best possible results. I mean, this is all we do our eyes. Yes, the eye is tiny, but it's very intricate.